On this hunt, I will be boating out to one of the seven Gulf Islands of British Columbia. I will be in search of one of the most elusive deer to hunt, the Columbia Blacktail deer. I have timed this hunt around the annual rut where bucks will be aggressively searching for does. My plan is to walk slowly, checking bedding areas while calling to hopefully draw a buck within range. At the landowner's request, I will not be using my bull while I'm here. Adding to that, it is illegal to use a rifle in this management unit. So for this hunt, I will be using a shotgun. Now there is very select times of the year when I hit these rattles, the bucks come running. Most times the bigger bucks hear the rattle wondering who is in their territory. Today was not one of those days. My family has been hunting these Southern Gulf Islands for generations. I remember as a young child looking back at some of the old photos of my granddad and listening to the stories of him talking about his dad hunting these Southern Gulf Islands. I absolutely love hunting these rainforests. There's so many little nooks and crannies a buck could pop up at any time. I know the area fairly well and we hunt swamps and tall grass. The bucks bed down in the tall grass and as I'm calling, you could sometimes see their antlers poke up or see an ear twitch. So we're just moving super slow while calling. We're just gonna get up over this little nub and up onto a little high spot up here. We should be able to draw bucks with a couple of calls out of the swamps. These trees are all scraped up. It's unbelievable how many trees are scraped up on this island. We did see some good bucks yesterday, but the circumstances just did not work out. So today, today's a good day.
Now I've heard does calling in their natural around here and it's more of a drawn out blah. So that's why I blow into the top of a can call. First two at 40 meters, second two at 50. And you can see in the footage he was staggering, so we're just gonna give him a minute. Obviously I like shooting until they stop, but he kept going. Not super thrilled about shotgun hunting, guys. Not super thrilled. He freaking came over and down, heading through the ocean. Now we're gonna drag him all the way back up. So cool, these black tails, though. All right, work begins. Boy, I tell you, I was missing my bow on this hunt. That buck stood there within, within my comfortable bow range. The shotgun, I'm not a fan, but I am very grateful for a buck in the freezer. I really enjoy being out on the water, which this hunt gets me out on the water, in the woods, sleeping on the boat, like we've done for generations in my family. Getting out here, moving slow, and just listening to nature means everything.